Yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I, I, I'm not gonna, you know, take too much with, like, like, too much, too much trying to explain what's gonna happen here, you know, because probably over like a million or a billion of you have, or have already like witnessed this jumping happen. So yeah, it's how Naruto and Sasuke jumped the him out of Momoshiki. Yo, before I get into the fight with Naruto and Sasuke, yeah. I just want to go over what Momoshiki did to the Kage. Because, yeah. bro, I know one of them considered retirement. Maybe considered a career in becoming a professional NPC because this job <laughs> is not for them. So shit opens up with Momoshiki one-shotting the right hand, kicks him right in the gut, and Brody went beaming down at the speed of sound. The whole squad saw that, and they started sweating. This was potentially the start of another five Kage squad wipe. They knew he was trouble. He rushes Gara and Gara shouts him with sand. The streets found out Gara's weakness was boxing, and they've been rushing him ever since. And bro is tired of it. Look at him. His face gives me flashbacks to part one Gara's evil ass. The hatred in his eyes is back. He ready to end him. But Momoshiki hits him with the reverse, traps him instead, and breaks out of the sand. Next, he hits Gara with the standing lariat. No momentum. Straight to the gut, and he goes falling down. The camera cuts to these two, and I'm staring with the Stephen A. Smith face, knowing damn well they about to get clapped. His next target is the Mizukage, and I can't blame him. Look at him. He punching the life out of that sword handle. That's how you know bro is free eats, free XP. He not built for this. He smacks him so hard that he got the sword flying out of his hand. And look at the angle he got him leaning at. Now this is crazy. He gets sent into a tree root and he leaves an angel imprint on straight bark. The last pocket out the four is on that. It is, it is, it is. Is. Not even bringing out her best jutsu for real. She put a bunch of rocks over her hand and called it a day. Didn't even bother wasting chakra. The punch gets blocked and Momoshiki's hitting her with the side eye. She gets one weave in, and I'm not gonna lie, that one dodge alone makes her have the best performance yeah. out of all of them. That's how sorry he got the Kage's looking. Bro. Anyways, Momoshiki one-shots her, <laughs> making her fall face first to the ground, and yeah, that's the end of those Kage's. And you know that post-game locker room talk about it be crazy. Yeah, like Naruto nothing. about to be in there like, And I mean this from the bottom of my heart. Y'all are trash. <laughs> like, Y'all are so trash. <laughs> I want you to know that I'm talking. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. Hey, you know it's a happy day when you see RBC, man. <laughs> Shout out RBC every day, man. I'm gonna have to take that shit back, man. I'm making her fall face first to the ground, and yeah, that's the end of those cockies. And you Sorry, know that post game man. locker room talk about it be crazy. Naruto about to be in there like, and I mean this from the bottom of my heart. Y'all are trash. Like y'all are so trash. I want you to know that I'm talking to you, so I'm going to say your name. Then I'm gonna call you trash. Yeah. Now it's time for Naruto. It starts off with the block and Momoshiki's impressed. He like, oh shit, so this is the main character. Naruto gets a couple more blocks in, and I really believed he was gonna beat the wash allegations. My questioning started happening in that arc with Shin. This dollar store Ujiha. Look at him, bro. He got in a Kosti robe with one cloud. That shit fake as hell. Bro fought that robe off at two. I'm crying. When I saw yeah, Naruto and Sasuke yeah, yeah, yeah. struggling with Shin Ujiha, I cried a little because I started to realize Father time caught up to them back then they would have packed them up in four seconds and it would only take one of them to do it like, come on. rose power is moving metal weapons he would be a normal earthbender in core i swear everyone and their mom know the metal bend over there he yeah. wouldn't be special but anyways yeah, special, in the second half momoshiki starts absolutely washing him Bro smacks him, kicks him, does a jumping kick, and then hits him with the Hadouken. And the cameraman is like, hold up, let me get a different angle real quick. And goes right behind Naruto. And man, remember the cameraman like this for school fights? He needed them. This one right here is a professional. He's getting all the angles. But the cameraman in school fights be recording like they're in the fight. And the cameraman's like, no, 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 this is like crazy. But anyways, back to the fight. Momoshiki smacks Naruto so hard that it had him swirling. Naruto was perplexed. He like, no way I just got done like that. So of course he had to get back. He attacks him and gets blocked. And Momoshiki's looking at Naruto like he a mismatch. And for good reason too, because Momoshiki then proceeds to knock the rings out of bro. He hits him again and does his spin move. Naruto blocks that attack though and looking at that face you think he turned shit around but he doesn't because he gets blocked and momoshiki starts going to work 
He did him crazy. He gut checks him, mm. hits him with the spin move, then elbows him in the back, making him hit the run animation. Next, he gives him a taste of what Sasuke felt in that final valley, because he starts comboing his torso and Naruto just looking like, damn, is mm. that what that shit feels like? Mm. And this send off was cold, because Momoshiki hits bro with the one inch punch, mm. sending bro away, and then he's like, hold up. Wait a minute, goes back to him and palms the hell out of his head, looking like 96 Jordan. So Sasuke's weak ass thought he was Batman, tried to hit Momoshiki with a silent takedown, but he had high alert in his class setup. He was not getting caught lacking. He turns around, checks him, and grabs him by the head as well. Momoshiki drags him, and Naruto's holding his hand out like he's gonna jump through the screen and help him. Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. You're on your own. He takes off, comes back down, and drags him across the ground on some Broly shit. Next, he tosses them both away, and Naruto gets back up talking about some impressive. Um, we, they really hit us with that whole anime cliche. You can't tell me this the first time you've seen this play out. Always somebody getting boom, tossed 30 feet away and getting back up on some. Looks like I have a formidable opponent. And they swear they're cold for saying that, bro. You're not him. Stop it. So they learn how to attack attacking. They ready for round two. And they hit him with this big ass explosion. So I'm sitting here thinking Momoshiki got cooked. Thought it was time to go home. But then we see that bro block. Both of them taking no damage. So Naruto and Sasuke were like, oh, no, nah, we got to play this shit off. So they both use that moment of weakness to power up real quick. And they go right back to boxing. But even after all that, he was still holding them all. He sent Sasuke flying. And bro started showing us why he could be a blue lock candidate. Started showing some crazy footwork. Controls the sword and kicks it right at bro. But I'm not going to lie. He did all that for no reason. Because that shit gets smacked away. But hey. It was clean though. Yeah. Naruto got baked in the last one, so you know he had to run it back. He calls Iso a Momo Shiki and gets to work. They move in so fast that I gotta slow it down. This choreography is crazy though. So Momo Shiki tries to slap the shit out of Naruto again, and he looks appalled he even tried it. Momoshiki tries to headshot him, he weaves it, and starts smiling. And Momoshiki's over there like, oh shit, you actually nice. Naruto breaks his lock, causing him to be off balance, but he recovers. Then he grabs Naruto's wrist, hits the side, and does a spin move, but Naruto blocks it again. Bro does a whole nother spin move, Naruto dodges it, blocks him again, and he tries to sneak a kick in, but now we on that. But now it's time for Naruto to go on offense, he kicks his arm, chops his neck, and comes in with a meat. That shit had him yelling like, then Sasuke comes in with a dumbass kick to the face. That's sneak, man. That's sneak. And we see Sasuke hitting the Ninja Jordan. Nah, I know a lot, man. This is Jordan. Jordan. This, this, this is a whole lot, man. Yeah, yeah, this right. fight is actually, you know. I've seen it. Yeah. yeah. And man. Naruto's just like, man, shut your bitch. And he's up in the air just looking like this. Mm. And they got that chase down <laughs> Hall of Fame. Look at what they doing just to get to it. It's never that serious. So they face off again. And what you're about to witness is the definition of good defense, better offense. <laughs> yeah. So Sasuke starts off by throwing two shurikens at Momoshiki. And bro, I swear Sasuke never leaves the crib without those damn mm. wire strings. Mm. He breaks the shurikens up, pulls it down. And look at this boy Momoshiki. He is out there moving. Mm. After all those dodges, Weed Nation was getting ready to sign him. Mm. But nah, they caught bro on fraudulent behavior. Because the second <laughs> homie gets a cut, he said, oh nah. And this almighty push. And I'm just watching my thing. Why did you do all that dodging shit if you could just push it away? And then it hit me. Brody just wanted to show off. He knew the cameras was on. I'm not gonna lie. I'd probably do the same thing too. I need me my little highlight reel. Come on now. But anyways, the shuriken pops out the ground and Brody dodges it by jumping back. Mm. And it's revealed the whole time that the shuriken was Naruto. Mm. And bro pops out with the Rasen shuriken. So after seeing that, he's like, hold up. I could just absorb this shit. Mm. But the play wasn't over because Sasuke comes out that shit ready to pounce. And I'm just mm. watching like, damn, bro. They done hit bro with 30 pump <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Wrong. We see bro smirking, revealing that he was prepared for this shit all along. And then we see the chains he got in his hand. He uses it to tie up Sasuke. He thought it was over, talking about some, come here. But Sasuke had one. You're not him. You're not way, him. And it's yeah, the you. to swap Stop places. That. You know in bro's head, he like, mm. <laughs> because at this point, it's like, all right, bro, I dodged all your shurikens, was ready to absorb the attack, and I was ready for the fake. It's like, come on, coach, I left it all on the court. What else am I supposed to do? Mm -hmm. And the answer is nothing but catching this right hook. Mm -hmm. Crazy. 
smack the taste out of his mouth. He gets sent <laughs> beaten down, and Sasuke ends it by putting him in a planetary devastation. Now, I know the fight is technically not over, but this is where that hand-to-hand -hand combat ended for him, and that's all I was here for. So with that being said, thank you for 213K. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Takes me back to the good old days, man, where they screw up in Naruto, man. Ugh. Where they squared up for real, man. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen. He's really sleep, y'all. We see this today, man. Man, I'm just relaxed today. Man. We most are. Most people who, who, who black out because of sleep say they relaxed as well. But then, like we say, we are out. Enjoy your day, enjoy your weekend, guys.